this is the contents of my Model Railway cupboard. All now to the cupboard. You can see I've got quite a few boxes there. Got that mess on the table there at a minute. And all this lot on the floor as well. Goes all the way here. Uh, you can throw into there as well some of the Metcalf kits. Go and get that all back into this cupboard here. I'll just pull back a bit. So that's all got to fit in there. Hopefully a bit neater this time. So that's the cupboard finally finished and tidied up. Just a quick tour of what we've done. So on the doors, I've got two pin boards. This one's got my port motors and some plastic kits for me to build up at a later date. On this door, we've got some more plastic kits to build up. This is all N-gauge stuff on this side. The opposite side was double O gauge. In the cupboard itself, I've got my double O gauge stuff over on the left-hand side and N-gauge stuff on the right, a smidge of the double O gauge stuff, sorry, the O gauge stuff on the top. I've got me little unit there to keep all my small bits and pieces. Uh, so on this side, I've got most of the N gauge wagons and trains all down there. All different boxes with my Oxford vehicles in N gauge. Metcalf buildings, either fully built or part built on there. On this side, I've got all my double O gauge Oxford vehicles in the brown boxes. Uh, one box to keep all me lighting and wiring bits and pieces in there. I've got double gauge coaches and wagons and the cranium from that middle one there. O gauge coaches, double double gauge coaches on the bottom, and the bottom three boxes there. It's all the double O gauge metcalfs. Next to the brown boxes, I've got uh, some wagons there, some more wagons there, and quite a few locos, which I didn't realise I've got so many. That's those there. On the bottom, I've got all my magazines. Middle and left, these are just my main toolboxes. I've got a couple of Metcalfs on display there. And got my scenery bits and pieces in the middle there. On the top, like I say, I've got N-Gage Metcalf kits over on the right, all together. On the left hand side, I've got my double O gauge Metcalf kits all together. It's taken us about three hours to get the cover sorted out, but I must admit it's looking a lot better.